welcome to Yoga with Esther. This is part outtake number three. The first one, the camera just slowly slid down until you could see nothing but my dirty ground. And in the second one, it completely cut off my head and then slid down. So today we're going to be focusing on the core. So, Science, um, Dr. Science, no, I'm just kidding. These are, this is like an actual like peer reviewed article by like Harvard or something. It says that part of the reason that exercises like Pilates and yoga can have a positive effect on our emotional state is because of the core aspect of it. But um, this no. Because of the core muscle building aspect of it, so let's start. Um, again, if there's anything that doesn't feel good, don't do it. Listen to your body. So I want you to first get into a stable position. I always like to take a step back, or just whatever feels good. Unlock your knees. I want you to pretend like you're hugging a beach ball. Now. We are literally going to just move from side to side, but with a twist. Ha <laughs> ha, I'm full of puns today. Sorry, I just ate a bunch of banana pudding. Probably not a good idea. So we're holding a beach ball and we're letting our abs twist us from side to side. So if you're going like this, you will probably feel a pulling on your back. I want everything to be directed at our core. So keep breathing for five, four, three, two, one, and release. Okay, let's just inhale our hands above our head. You can't see my hands, that's fine. Exhale them down. And we're going to move directly to our mat. Um, because my hips are janky, I've been sitting on a block, but you guys can sit however you would like. Sit up straight, nice and tall, and we're going to begin with our breathing exercises. So in for three, out for four. We're going to do this three times. Inhale. Exhale everything out of your mouth. <sighs> Relax your shoulders and let's begin. Inhale for one, two, three. And exhale for one, two, three, four. Inhale for one, two, three. And exhale for one, two, three, four. One more time. Inhale. And exhale. Let's bring our hands behind our head and you can kind of open up your chest here. And then relax your shoulders down. We're just gonna do a side to side crunch. So we're not gonna do exactly side to side. We're gonna go more directionally in front, just by a hair. So take a deep breath. We're gonna do three sets. So inhale, exhale. One. Keep breathing. Two. Inhale your hands up. Exhale, right hand outside of left thigh, left hand behind you. We're going to come into our twist. Remember, sit up straight and tall, abdominals engaged this whole time. Chin in line with torso. Breathe with your chest for three, two,
turn towards me, release, other side. Inhale, exhale. With our chests for three. Two. And one. And I want everyone to to all fours, so knees under hips, wrists under shoulders. We're going to do cat-cow. When we get to the cat part, I want you to crunch. I want you to send your belly button to your, uh, your spine, okay? So take a deep inhale and exhale. As you exhale, really crunch your stomach for three. Inhale, two. too yoga-y, but working on our core is yoga-y, we're going to come into a plank pose. So I want you guys to interlace your fingers together, elbows underneath shoulders, and you can either come to a full plank if this feels good and you know what you're doing, that means no slumping, or you can come down to your knees and untuck your toes. They're both fine. Adjust yourself. Make sure that you feel good here. Ab really nice and tight. We're going to stay here for four more breaths. And gently lower yourself to the ground. We're going to come to Sphinx Pose. I want you to press your toes into your mat. Press your fingertips into your mat, elbows, underneath shoulders, head at mat. We're going to stay here for four breaths. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Three more. Now we get to roll over to our backs. So be it challenging, it's a really good exercise to build our core strength. You can do this two ways. So we're going to bring our knee into our chest and you're going to press your hands into your knee, or your, I'm sorry, your upper thigh, as well as pressing your upper thigh into your hand, so it's like, and then we're gonna drop and do, and if you feel like, you know, eh, I'm really, really strong, you can curl your neck up as you do this. I do not feel like that today, so I'm not gonna do it. We're gonna do uh, five sets. So take a deep breath, inhale, exhale, press, lower down. Inhale, press, really let your abs guide you. That's four. Three, keep pressing. Two, and last one. Good job, I'm assuming. <laughs> oh. Okay, we are going to pelvic tilt it out. So, it's a really subtle move, so if you need to zoom in, I don't know if you can zoom in or not, zoom in. But it's literally, I'm trying to flatten my back on the mat and lift my pelvis up. Can you see that? It's like, it's like if I was like dancing, like, I'm like a really bad dancer, and I'm like... <laughs> it's kind of like that. So what we're going to 
gonna do is we're gonna do it slowly though. Press your heels into your mat. Take a deep breath. And exhale. As you curve that spine and you tilt your pelvis, we're gonna hold for three, two, one. Release. Two more times. Take a deep breath. Exhale, curve for three, two, one. Release. Last time. Three, two, one. And release. We're gonna rock our knees from side to side. Remember, your core is directing your legs. So I don't wanna see any of this because that's just pulling on your back it's literally going to look something like this, where your abs are tight and they're directing the movement of your knees. We're going to do this for four breaths. Breathe with me. Three. Two. One. And release. Okay, let's just do a little... Final alignment, opening up the hips. Three breaths here, laying down butterfly, sutta bada kanasana ka ka ka. I don't know. I used to know all these names in Sanskrit. Now I just, I'm like laying down open legs pose. Take a deep inhale. Send your breath to your inner thighs and exhale, let go of any resistance you're holding on to. Two. And one. And actually, we're gonna do our little crunches here. So bring your hands behind your neck. And when I mean little, I mean little. Chin will come into chest. We're gonna come up for three and come down for three. So it's gonna be really really slow. Take a deep breath and as you exhale come up for one, two, three. Abs are strong. Down, two, three. Up, two, three. Down, two, three. Last one. Up, two, three. And down, two, three. You can open your arms wide if you want. Nice little stretch here. And let's all do a full body stretch. Point your toes. Deep breath here. And release. Okay, so our last exercise is um, bridge pose. It's going to be a lifting bridge pose. So again, if anything doesn't feel good, don't do it. I want you to press your heels into your mat, close to your glutes, hands come down by your side, take a deep breath, and slowly roll yourself up to a bridge, clench your glutes, and we're gonna lower ourselves down for three, two, one. So we're gonna do one up and then three down. So we're quick up, slow down. Inhale, up, squeeze your glutes, three, two, one, down, three more, up, three, two, one, two more, up, three, two, one, last one, up, three, two, one, and release. Take a deep inhale, exhale. I just want you to pull your right knee in towards your chest and breathe here for five deep breaths. Three more. one and release 
other side. Two more breaths. Gently roll yourself over to the right side of your mat. We're going to take five breaths here. Close your eyes. Or if you don't feel comfortable, just relax your eyes. Is it this glass? Hmm. Just pause your day here. Think about how awesome I am. Just kidding. Maybe think about something that makes you happy. Banana pudding makes me so happy. It's three in the morning, you guys. Give me a break. <laughs> Use your hand, press yourself up gently. We are gonna take our final three breaths together. Deepest breaths of the whole day. Inhale. Exhale, hands, heart center. Inhale, deep breath. Exhale, hands, heart center. Deepest breath of the whole day. Inhale, everything in. And exhale. Thank you so much for joining me today. Um, I miss you, and I love you guys, and I can't wait to give you all big hugs. Namaste. Again, my name is Esther. Email me, call me, text me, come over if you have any questions, comments, concerns.